Okay, boys and girls, in my last video, I said I had made a semi-major purchase. And that was, as I showed you, this guy right here. I bought this orbital buffer. That was my second semi-major purchase. Blah, blah, blah. Um, I bought that buffer specifically. Camera's up here, buddy. And, uh, and of course, sand and dirt on the lens. Or is there? On, oh, there's something inside the lens. What the hell? Yeah, okay. Sidetracked. Stay focused. Life of Chuck. Um, yeah, I bought that buffer for the main reason of next weekend is Justin Incredibles CamperCon. And I want to clean up the outside of this van a bit. If you notice, I got to polish this off. A little bit of rust there. I want to bring some shine into the van and also I got some leftover whatever goo here that I might have to SOS off or something else and I got a little, little bit there. So my focus when I get time is to clean this up a little bit better. Um, the other reason why I, I wanted to buy some other accessories. Uh, Ryobi has some pretty neat products. They have lights, they have fans, they have radios, uh, Bluetooth radios, all that'll run off an 18 volt. So my first purchase was this. I went out and bought this kit. It was 129 bucks and you get charger, you get two batteries, uh, two 18 volt batteries, wherever I put it. Uh, yeah, two of these guys and uh, so that was the kit. Then I went out and bent, spent 59 bucks buying the polisher and those are the two items that I got right now um, probably this week and I will buy a light and then maybe after that I don't know about this year but they have a little fan a remote fan and they also have uh, I'm gonna buy a Bluetooth radio and then these I'm just gonna take this charger and charge it up at work simple and when I need it I got an extra battery, so that is a plan. I do have a DeWalt 20 volt system, but I'm gonna sell it off, recoup some of my money. I've only used it to build the other gold Chevy van, and it's hardly got any use. So I'm gonna sell that, and I'm gonna go with the Ryobi system. A Little bit cheaper, but it offers more product line. Uh, yeah, jigsaws, uh, circular saws, everything. So what the hell? Why not? Um, mobile tools. So anyways, um, I don't know what I'm going to film after this. So, <laughs> cheers. Oh, okay. Uh, a little bit smoky. Hell yeah. That building, that's a block away. So, uh, yeah. Tad too smoky for me. I'm choking a bit. Throat is scratchy. So, oh well. So is life. Okay. Today and tomorrow are going to be somewhat of a crazy day because um, yeah leaving for Winnipeg tomorrow uh, I've got five hours of sleep I got a lot of things to do I got a pack I've got to figure out what I'm taking I have to find my two daughters some kind of gift um, touristy type of gift something about Vancouver I've been looking for a week haven't find nothing so I'm going downtown it's gonna take an hour to drive there hour back running out of time and I got to meet one awesome inch and a friend uh, at six o'clock it's two o'clock I got four hours and I'm running on four hours of sleep uh, and I work at 9 30 tonight I'll get no sleep because I gotta be at Korean girls place tomorrow before eight o'clock to go to the plane so I'm gonna get one hour's sleep tomorrow so I'm, yeah, I'm running on uh, fumes. That's okay. Got to do what we got to do because you know what? I'm freaking awesome. Just like you guys. And uh, I'm taking the car downtown because the big monster van is too hard to move around and park. Iconic Stanley Park. La -de da You know what? Here's where I'm going to go actually because there is a little 
store right by the Thunderbirds here or whatever you want to call them. Totem poles, that's the name I'm looking for. Yeah, you can't see much of the harbor because there's still a good chunk of smoke out there. She willikers, wow. And the cruise ship lines are right there. And actually, right there, that's the seaplane where we took off to go to Nanaimo. Okay, I'm going to this place because I remember seeing it two years ago and it had stuff that I wanted to get my kids, so we're back. Okay, mission accomplished. I'll uh, show you what I got in a bit. Hold it. Okay, this is what I picked up for them. Um, my oldest daughter was asking me to bring back a shark tooth because when we visited BC um, 10 years ago, yeah, almost 10 years ago, she had bought a um, shark tooth necklace here. So I decided to get him a different necklace this time because this is all I could manage. And uh, my oldest one will get the totem pole my youngest, because she likes Native American culture stuff, this is hers. And I got them each a keychain. And, um, yeah, 50 bucks worth of junk. <laughs> oh, my God. As a minimalist? Yeah. What the hey. And, um... <clears throat> and, uh... I did buy them a pair of socks the other day representing Vancouver too, so uh, I don't have that on camera, so you don't get to see it. Anyways, we're over and out. Um, it didn't take me as long as I thought it was going to, so I can, I'm going to get a bite of food in. Um, yeah, awesome. That's really it for this one, guys. I look forward to seeing you in my next video, and until then, as always, stay awesome.